I see a lot of future. Um, it's a it's still a pretty virgin territory that hasn't been tapped yet. Um, it's already growing in the in the West, you know, with uh, Adley and SponsorTweets.com, uh, working with celebrities like Kim Kardashian. This has become somewhat regular, um, but still in Asia, it's in its infancy. So there's a lot of growth potential. One thing that we see a lot of potential in is. Um, so you can say video blogging or casual casual video um, where celebrities are basically taking video of themselves and posting it directly to their own way wall. So um, it's we found that you know comparing the, the, the quality and the sort of interactivity that you get from a video versus a photo versus a pure text uh, social media update like a Weibo post, um, obviously the video is strongest. So if you can sort of boil it down to the most intimate personal video um, Say, for example, having a celebrity just talk about their experience with the product and film it themselves without a lot of packaging and fancy video production. Um, that's one that I think there's a lot of future for. One of the one of the ones that we've seen personally is uh, it's a difficulty with some clients on trusting the celebrity to sort of share their own experience without you know sort of forcing a lot of ad speak or you know product details that they want to mention. The you know the, the the results will always be better if the celebrity lets them talk about what they want to talk about. You know you can mention sort of highlight some details, but if, if you're crafting the message too strongly, then it won't be authentic to the celebrity's fans, and they'll know it, and it'll feel like, wow, he's just uh, you know doing a commercial as opposed to talking about his own feelings. So um, this is one that we found that we've always tried to push the client to let the, let the celebrity talk about um, things in their own way.